Valencia Basket veteran Romain Sato took a much tougher route to success than most players in the Turkish Airlines Euroleague. The 33-year-old, who won the title with Panathinaikos in 2011, was born in the Central African Republic and found himself growing up in a horrible situation as the country was plunged into civil war. It's very dangerous, you know, we can't go nowhere. It's hard. We don't have food, we don't have anything to eat. I mean, you, you just gotta hope when things slow down. You can't go outside, we're just in the house. All we can hear is just a gun shot anywhere, all day, all night. I mean, your family trying to do whatever they can to get you food, but it's never easy. You might be lucky to eat today, you might not. It might be three, four days before you can eat anything. So, I mean, it's, it's tough life. Amazingly, basketball offered Romain a route to a better life. After taking up the sport as a teenager, within a few years, he was heading for the United States. I got a chance to start playing for my friend basketball, and as soon as I started, I, I never stopped. Just working hard, you know, and we had a one guy from our country living in D.C., so he helped me with an exchange program student. So that's when I get a chance to go in the U.S. from school. The transition to life in the U.S. wasn't easy, especially at first when he moved to the frozen northeastern state of Ohio and had a severe case of culture shock. I don't, don't speak no English. You go to Ohio, it's snow, cold. I never see snow before. <laughs> I mean, it, it's just crazy. At times, Romain even felt like giving up and moving back to Africa but he kept himself motivated by the thought of helping his family back home. It's hard for me in my first years because I feel like, man, I can't do it. I have to go back home. But I feel like God brought me there for the reason, you know, so I have to work hard and hopefully one day I can help my family. That's why I don't have my mind. I said, now I'm out. So I'm the only one got out, so I have to make sure I can take care of the rest of them. So I have to work hard and I see it in front of me there's no room for me to quit. The rest is history, as Romain received the scholarship to play basketball at college and has subsequently rose to become a EuroLeague champion with Panathinaikos in 2011. But he has never forgotten home and is now attempting to improve the lives of youngsters in his native country by organizing and paying for basketball camps every summer. Basically, I do for the peace because a lot of kids don't have a chance to play basketball. I'm trying to get some organization to help them at least go in the camp and provide for them to at least do something, be fun. Just forget about all these things going on now, just to focus on a little bit positive thing. You know we can do something positive for them, but that's the only thing I'm trying to do this summer, just to give them my help and cheer them up a little bit.